So the project for Hidden Door this year is called Staging a Gaze. It is a dual channel 35mm slide projection, which has so, two um, like carousel projectors that are linked together and play in total 162 slides. And the project really started when we were both doing like, separate research projects at the National Museum of Scotland. Um, we were writing a paper for the Emerging Perspectives Conference run by the Association for Art History. And, um, our idea was that we were going to think about this, like, the museum as being locked in the cabinet of curiosities and think about curation, power and identity. Ben had been looking at the, what was it, the Islamic talisman? Yeah, it was a, a collection of Islamic talismans and astrolabes, which had been almost miscatalogued within the museum, really. And um, you, um, were, you, were, you, you were also studying a collection at the National Museum of Scotland of Jacobite material culture. Exactly that, and I was particularly interested in feminist practices of curation, and in maybe like dissolving the museum into a more social space, and, or even in just sharing different approaches to interacting with objects. And so we were both in NMS a lot together, and we thought, hang on a minute, we're both sculptors, we're based at Edinburgh Sculpture Workshop, maybe we should look at their sculpture gallery upstairs. That seems important for us to do. So we went and we thought, okay, let's just take a few photos because photographs are the way in which we start to develop relationships with these objects and it's important for us to, be, to reframe our gaze and to be aware of the different ways in which we're approaching them. And we came back and looked at the photographs we'd taken and we saw these really interesting like, similarities coming up between a couple of sculptures in that collection um, called Asclepios and Dionysus. And they were, they were similar because they're made of the, the same material marble. They're made of the, yeah, the same marble and they have the same kind of surface texture. But when we, so we started to research these two sculptures a bit more and we realised that they were both from the same archaeological site, Cyrene in northern Libya. And um, we start, this kind of made us wonder how did they end up here and is there more of a kind of story linking these two statues. And so we started, we continued researching through taking photographs and we um, we both share the same camera, which is um, Olympus uh, OM1, and that allowed us to kind of like share lenses and we use a macro lens to look at these like breaks and fissures on the sculpture's surface, which revealed a bit more about the history. And it was kind of amazing. We were using our like mobile phones as a light meter, and Ben was like, "Oh, cat, could you just go to that toe on Asclepius's foot? We need to make sure we catch, you know, catch this just at the right angle and the contrast is right." And the photograph, was like, yeah, yeah, okay. I put my phone in front of it and on the light meter this like text started to emerge on the sculpture that we couldn't see with our own eyes and it was the accession number like etched into the skin of the stone and it it was so fascinating for us because we realised that actually bringing digital technology into this work as well and thinking about the many different lenses that shape the politics of our gaze in this museum setting could perhaps help us to unlock new relationships or narratives around and with these sculptures.